Uh, listen, I, I listen to Jules' interview, and I don't think there's anything wrong with with he's he set up at the team four three three. Um, at the end of the, the interview, he spot on. There was no aggression. They didn't get close to him. People weren't tracking their runners. People weren't weren't getting against who they were meant to get against. And it's plain and simple. You can go on and you can talk to your blue in the face about the tactical side of the game, but it was a uh, the alarming thing for me was the amount of space that Celtic got certainly in the wide areas um, and that's something that I'm sure Gio would have been speaking about um, the last couple of days privately been through the 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 game he'll go through that he'll, he'll sit the players down make sure they watch that because I don't think that will happen again it can't happen again How are they reacting to the criticism Barry? It's part of it Dave will tell you when you play at the old firm and you get a defeat I've been in the, the receiving end of a a couple of doings from Celtic and it's not nice but that's listen it's part and parcel of being an old fun player I'm but afraid. was it ever because of lack of effort I don't remember that being no, the case li- no just because you get beat by your closest rivals listen I get beat a few times as I said 6-2 and 5-1 um, I think it was um, but one thing about it is we were still getting close and we're still attempting to close them down and, and showing a bit of aggression I didn't see that it slightly changed in the second half but as I said it's easy when you're 3-0 down and um, the, the, po- the only positive really I can take out of the game was seeing Ryan Jack back in a Rangers jersey yep. the second 45 mm-hmm. minutes he was I one that did. showed what it's all about mm-hmm. good quality on the ball but also showed a bit of heart and determination Davy, what did you see you've reflected on it you've watched it yeah, back I mean, the, the, the one thing that you don't expect to get in an old firm game is time on the ball Um because the, the pace is normally so frantic and it was just astonishing to see Celtic getting the ball into their, their wide player's feet and Abada and Jota being able to take a couple of touches get turned and get running it at either fullback. Um, when, you know, if, if you're a fullback playing in that game you are wanting to nail the wide player mm. as he's receiving the ball. You, you don't want to give them time. Mm. And Rangers just stood off Celtic. And it was all the more remarkable because Rangers, within five minutes, we said, look... There's no high press from Rangers. They've come to sit in, maybe win the game in a counter-attack. Maybe that's the idea. But by sitting deep and compact should make it easier for Rangers to go and put the bite on Celtic. That There was no bite at all. Yeah, you could see his game plan was to sit off, as David just mentioned. Once they come into Rangers half, you have got to go and close the ball down. I mean, I don't know. I, I couldn't believe. I was astonished with the amount of room. And I keep going back to it, the amount of room that Abada and Jota got. Mm-hmm. For me, Ian Mark they two before the game and say, really two danger men, no doubt about it. And if you give good players space and time, they're going to hurt you. And that's what Rangers done. Um, slightly different in the second half when they made the changes. But as um, as the caller said there, mm. it was too late. Tell Alexa to launch Go Radio or listen on the Go Radio app.